Hello and welcome to another video. Slightly different today, no bike, just the rucksack. We've got a hammock today. So, hammock's gonna go there, in between these two trees. Hopefully it fits, I haven't set it up before. And I've actually never slept in a hammock before, so today is a day of many firsts for me. Um, a bit anxious to be honest excited but anxious as well the plan for today is to cook some lecho it's a hungarian dish to stew with some uh, paprikas mushrooms um tomatoes and bits and pieces so yeah um that'll be quite nice hopefully first order of business is to set up the hammock i need to find some decent sticks to set up the cooking station and i suppose in a few hours I'll start the cooking. I've got I've got some time to mess around with a hammock and stuff. So I guess you get to enjoy it with me. My very first, well, I've set up the hammock before with Lily, but this will be the first time when I'm actually planning to sleep in it. So fingers crossed, everything goes well. And if it doesn't, I'm sure you'll hear about it. That side is definitely too high, but apart from that, looking good. Okay, so dinner preparations are ongoing. It's, um, I've been here for about well, nearly two hours now. Just chilling out a little bit on the hammock. I cut up nice three pieces of wood, fresh wood, equal sizes. I've joined them together using the guy ropes. And I've also finished this. So I'm gonna hang that stick like so. And then I've got my pot here and my pot will go on there and all i've got left to do is to dig out a hole for a fire i've seen a guy doing a tea fire so basically you can control the amount of heat you got underneath the underneath the pot so i might give that a go it's a day of many firsts so might as well i've got a little shovel um so i'll just dig out a little hole it's a nice piece of ground here there isn't really a lot going on Okay, my tea is ready. Um, so this is how it's looking. The tripod will be over here somewhere. And then I can lift it up or lower it down if I need to, move it around slightly, but this is how it's gonna look near enough. Right, it's pretty late. So I best start prepping the food. What are the ingredients? Right, Silesian sausage, kielbasa Śląska, main ingredient. Um, some red onions, just because I like bread, any onions will do. Two red chilies, um, three paprikas, and mushrooms. I'm not going to bore you with the cutting, I'll do that on my own. We'll skip to the good part, eh?
And for anyone wondering, I've got four litres of water. So in case this thing gets out of control, I've got something to stop it with. And there's plenty of ground all around for me to hush it out in case I need to. So the fire's going, it's going pretty well. Um, so yeah, not long now, I reckon. All the wood's starting to look a bit white. We'll start moving it over to the leg of the tea and we'll put the pot over. I've still got um, mushrooms and peppers to cut up, but the onion and, uh, and the sausage is in, already in the pot. Still warming up, needs a bit of time. Hopefully not too long. Man's hungry. Right, we'll leave that there, cover it up. I need to add some more logs underneath. Chili paste. Chopped tomatoes. And spices. Let that stew for however long it takes. And um, I can't wait to eat. I'm I'm starving, absolutely starving. I've got to tell you this uh, this tea fire um, is a bit of a fail, really, because you know the guy. Obviously, YouTube video. The guy on the video says how it's great. You know, you can cook. Um, you know, you can have something slow burning. Uh, slow cooking something then you can have something on a high heat and all the rest of it but I just found that I've got to keep moving the uh, the burning logs to the leg like the burning logs from this side over to there constantly otherwise it just doesn't maintain the heat maybe I'm doing it wrong I don't know let me know what you think if um, if there is a different way of doing it time has finally come to enjoy the feast. Looking tasty, let's go. All I need is my baguette now, and we're ready to yam. I can't wait. The massive pot is here, and it's the taste test. Smells good, but it's still quite hot. And spicy, God.
Perfect. Okay, I think that's about as far as we're going to get tonight. Um, to be completely honest with you, I still haven't properly eaten my food. That pot holds so much heat, it's unreal. I mean, it doesn't help that the dish is very spicy, granted, but I'm starving and it's just so hot and the heat and the spice of it I just, I can't. Anyway, I'm going to try and get through it now. Um, but, um, that will be the last one for tonight. I'll see you in the morning, alright? Morning. Right, so that's the first night in the hammock ticked off. Um, that's a quite decent experience to be fair. Um, I've had a little bungee strap for the net to stay up, so that was good. Came with the hammock itself. The only thing I noticed was that the sleeping bag was a bit moist um, on my back. I think it was just, um, condensation or just me being a bit sweaty um, and that, all that heat escaping and it was a bit uh, yeah so it was a bit damp between the mat, sleeping mat and the bag um, that's why I'm having the sleeping bag hanging up a little bit here just to get get rid of some of that moisture before I can put it away I'm still full from the dinner because I didn't actually finish eating until probably like an hour before I went to bed. Uh, I couldn't finish all of it. I, f I chucked the rest in the fire. Um, but yeah, this is what it's looking like here. And yeah, before I cover it all up, I'll just make sure it's all fully put out. I did run my hand over it. There isn't any heat left anymore, so should be good. But, um, I won't be sitting around here for too long. I'll literally just make a quick coffee and start packing up, I think. That should do it. I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, coffee has been had. I am ready to go home. Away. It's quite a nice thing, it just packs into the little bag that you can use it as a pouch when it's out, so that's pretty decent. How's that for a quick pack up?
I pack up the rest in the bag. I've got my rubbish in the black bag. There's some bins in the car park. So I'll just carry that. Till then. And that's it. Cova Cure. Nice. Right, the campsite's all packed up. Only one little stick left. See you later, mate. And that is it, off we go. Someone had a feast. A bit like me last night. Okay guys, this is it from me for today. I'm a bit out of breath. This area is very hilly. But it's nice, very nice. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking up, sticking this this long. Whoever did, um, please consider subscribing. And um, yeah, that's it from me. See you later. Wolf.